Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel Word Act Language Classes. How are you all? I'm fine over here. These days I've come to my hometown on holidays and it's always good to be back home. But being on holidays doesn't mean that I'm off duty. I've also realized that it's my responsibility to bring new content for all of my viewers on a regular basis. And so here I am with another video on English. What are we going to learn today? You must be wondering. Well, today we are going to learn about different durations of time in days, months and years. Let's begin. Number one sentence. I am on holiday for seven days. I am on holiday for seven days. In this sentence, the time indicator that I have used is seven days. Instead of seven days, what can we use? The sentence will be, I am on holiday for one week. One week. Ye baat hui ek hafte ki. Agar isi sentence mein hume seven days ki jaga pe 15 days use karna ho to hum kya karenge? The sentence will be, I am on holiday for 15 days. In this sentence, if we want to replace 15 days, what can we use? We can use the word fortnight. What did I say? Fortnight. The sentence will be, I am on a holiday for one fortnight. Next sentence. I'm going to Manali for 30 days. Now in this sentence, instead of 30 days, what can we use? I'm going to Manali for a month. Now as we are talking about months, let's see another sentence. I have been preparing for my exam for three months. In this sentence, if we want to replace three months, what can we use? I have been preparing for my exam for a quarter of an year. Quarter of an year, I will tell you. Ek mein hote hai, hum sab jante hai. And if we divide those 12 months in 4 quarters, so each quarter contains 3 months. And that is what becomes a quarter of an year. Iske baad mein hote hai, 6 months, that what we call half year. And after that, the whole year follows. Next, 365 days, ko hum bolte hai, ek saal, one year. What do we call 366 days? That is called a leap year. Leap year, ek baar aata hai, four years mein. Aur jab hamare calendar mein, February ke month mein, 28 days ki jaga, 29 days hoote hai, us year ko bola jata hai, leap year. One year ke completion ko, hum bolte hai, anniversary. Anniversary. French mein, isi word ko bola jata hai, anniversary. English may anniversary, French may anniversary. After that, 10 years. What do we call 10 years? We call it a decade. The word is decade. Bossy log is word ko galat pronounce karte hain. They, they say it like decade, but it's not decade, it's decade. After 10 years comes another stage that is 25 years. 25 years ko, ek bhoat hi common term hai. It's called Silver Jubilee. Silver Jubilee. Ye term aap mein se bhoat logo ne suna hooga. Usually wedding anniversaries pe, is term ka use hota hai whenever a couple completes their 25 years of marriage. After that comes the Golden Jubilee, jo hota hai 50 years ke completion pe. So ye do terms to bhoat common hai, right? Silver Jubilee and Golden Jubilee. लेकिन बहुत लोग ये नहीं जानते कि इस Golden Jubilee के बाद में भी दो stages होते हैं. One is, जब 60 years complete होते हैं, उसको बोला जाता है Diamond Jubilee and when 75 years are completed, that is called Platinum Jubilee. So, यहाँ पे हमारे पास चार stages हो गए, 25 years, Platinum Jubilee, I'm sorry, 25 years, Silver Jubilee, 50 years, Golden Jubilee, 60 years Diamond Jubilee and 75 years is Platinum Jubilee. And after 75 years comes the next stage that is 100 years. 
और हंड्रेड इयर्स को हम बोलते हैं वन सेंचुरी आई होप दिस वीडियो वॉज हेल्पफुल फॉर यू ऑल एंड आई होप दैट यू गेट टू लर्न सम न्यू थिंग्स फ्रॉम दिस वीडियो फॉर मोर सर्च अमेजिंग कॉन्टेंट एंड न्यू थिंग्स प्लीज स्टे ट्यून टू आर चैनल ऑल्सो लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब एंड ऑल्सो शेयर इट विद योर फ्रेंड्स एंड फैमिली सो दैट एवरी वन कैन लर्न न्यू थिंग्स अबाउट इंग्लिश लैंग्वेज एंड द फ्रेंच लैंग्वेज एज वेल This is me signing out. I'll see you in another video. Till then, take care. Au revoir. Bye bye.